So my first tip to becoming a writer, tip number one is to start. Put pen to paper, or if you use a laptop, just start writing. That is the, the most important thing. And thereafter, the story will flow, um, you'll get the ideas coming in. Main thing, tip number one, just start. Tip number two, to writing. So you've started and thumbs up and well done. However, through starting, you've got to have the right attitude and know the reasons what you're writing for and who you're writing for. All right, so map out, have a little plan and map out um, what you're writing and that will help you to formulate a nice plan in order to implement and continue with the writing process. So tip two, what is your attitude to what you're about to write? Plan and map out what you're doing. Tip number three, it is how long do you want your story to be? Is it a story? Is it a short story? Is it a blog? Is it a, a, um, an article? Is it a novel? Or, you know, is it a whatever? Knowing how long you want it to be, because this will govern the time that you're going to spend on writing and um, the content that you will write. Okay, so tip number three, how long would you like your story to be? Now take care, well done for starting, well done for formulating your plan, and now knowing how long you want it. Tip number four. So you have started, you've made the plan, and you've also um, decided what you want to write about. So the next important thing is finding your character. So if you're writing a story, like we spoke on tip number three, you want a hero. First off, figure out who your protagonist is, the hero of the story. All right? Once you work out, female, male, young, old, then you work in line with that, right? So next tip, number four, find out who your protagonist is, your hero of the story. Now, guys. Tip number, sorry, five. Tragedy. Sadly, in your story, there is a problem that needs to be solved, okay? Yes, that is the truth. So, what is the tragedy? And that is it. Finding us not a solution because it's not time for that yet. So what is the tragedy? And how does the protagonist, how is it, does it affect the protagonist? All right, so that's the next section. And then we're going to go into number six, which brings in another character to the story, all right? So, tragedy strikes. Tip number five, find out what that is.